Number 1. You need to buy cryptocurrency to fund your wallet. Cryptocurrency is needed to sell an NFT. All of the NFT marketplaces will require that you pay up front to mint your NFT. In most cases, the payment has to be made in cryptocurrency. That is why it's important to fund your wallet. So this means that before you can earn any cryptocurrency by selling your NFT, you'll need to buy some to cover the fees. The most commonly accepted currency is Ether, and this is because it is a native cryptocurrency of the open source blockchain platform Ethereum where NFTs were first launched. However, some platforms have started accepting varieties of payment formats. If you already own some Ether, you should make sure you have it in a digital wallet because you'll need to connect it to your chosen NFT platform to make and receive payments. Number 2. Creating a digital wallet to pay for your NFT This is accomplished on sites like MetaMask. You go to the website and click on the download button in the top right. While using a desktop computer, you will need to pick the option and install the browser extension. However, there is also the mobile app. You'll need to confirm that you intend to create a new wallet and seed phrase. Don't panic about what the seed phrase means. Just say yes, then all that is needed is a matter of agreeing to the terms, creating an unforgettable password, and making your way through security means. Afterwards, you'll have your account set up. Number three, connecting your wallet to an NFT platform. Many digital wallets function similarly. Whichever one you prefer, you will have to connect it to the NFT platform, and it is the platform that will help you sell the NFT. For example, you can use Rarible, but there are other NFT platforms to pick from similar to Rarible. When you visit Rarible.com, there's a button that reads Connect Wallet. Make sure you click, and on the next screen, you'll have to provide your wallet provider. A pop-up will allow you to connect your wallet with Rarible. Click Next, then Connect, accept the conditions and terms of service, and make sure you confirm you're above 13 years old. Number 4. Uploading the file you wish to turn into an NFT so, now that you have a wallet that's connected with Ether to make payments, the next step is knowing how to make and sell your NFT. If you are using the Rarible site, you have to click the blue Create button that is at the top right. You'll later be given alternatives to create a solitary, one-off work, or sell the same item many times. Number 5. Setting up an auction for your NFT You will need to select how to sell your NFT artwork. There are three options. Fixed price permits you to set up a particular price and sell your NFT immediately. The unlimited auction method permits people to make their bids until you finally accept one. Also, timed auction is an auction that lasts for a set time. Number 6. Adding a description to sell your NFT Now, you can name and describe your listing. To make sure that your NFT will sell, you should take some time to think about the title and description. You will then be asked to consider the percentage of royalties you wish to claim on any resale of your art in the future. This is a balancing act, as a high percentage will earn you money per sale in the long run, but this will also prevent people from reselling your art. Also, there's an optional field that requires adding your file's properties. With that complete, you're nearly done. Number 7. Paying the listing fee to sell your NFT the final step in discovering how to make and sell an NFT is by clicking Create Item and you'll have to connect with your wallet and pay the listing fee. If you don't have enough funds in your wallet, don't panic. You won't have to begin again. Just make sure to click on the wallet icon on the screen and you'll be given the choice of adding funds directly within Rarible. Before doing this, just a quick warning. The listing fee may be low, and before you can go further, you'll need to agree to an additional fee to generate your NFT. Where do NFTs sell? NFTs can be bought or sold on NFT marketplaces such as Rarible, OpenSea, and Foundation. Some of these are available for everyone, while others can only be accessed by invitation. Some are available for art, and there are some others available for video games. There are many NFT marketplaces for everyone, so make some good research and find the best one for you. Can I display my NFT art? Yes, you can. New NFT displays are released every time. These are 4K and 5K screens, but the best mostly have tactile anti-glare screens that make the art look like it's set on a canvas. A good example includes the frame by Samsung. 
Also, we can talk of screens from Mural and Convia. Make sure you look for screens that feature built-in NFT marketplace and some wallet connectivity from an application. What type of NFTs sell? The best-selling NFTs are those by known artists such as Damien Hurst and Beeple or those NFTs that possess utility. The latter will be relevant to many new NFT artists. This implies you have to create a collection that has a broader use than just being a digital asset. For instance, can it be utilized to enter real-life events, some community chat room, or to raise money for charity? 